Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about what could end up as the most expensive card ever. The bidding will be over in less than a little more than six days from the recording of this video and you can be sure that I'm going to give you the final price but as of now it is $19,000. $19,000 for a foil Tamagoyf. Now this foil Tamagoyf does have some interesting history to it. A pro magic player in the top eight of GP Vegas chose this card over a card lightning burst which went perfectly in his deck. Essentially he picked this card and he knew he wasn't going to play it and he first picked it. Now he was criticized extremely heavily by some notable pros who were, I guess the best way to describe it, disappointed that he picked this card over the correct pick. But this card was the correct pick. It's gonna make him, assuming the auction ends at like 70,000, which I can see, like maybe even 100, it'll make him $50,000. It'll give gamers helping gamers $50,000 in donation, which is fantastic. And on top of that, now he becomes a very well-known name. So what could he got from GP winning GP Las Vegas? No idea. Probably not very much because I don't even know who won GP Las Vegas. And there were two people who won it. What could he get by rare drafting this Tamagoyf, taking the criticism, uh, donating half the profit to charity? He's going to be one of the most famous Magic players in our community for a long time coming just because of this action. And it's a action that most of us would agree with. I would rare draft the Tamagoyf. I don't know why the pros are so eager to attack him. When you have a magic card that is worth that much money and the prize payout is not as good as this magic card. Essentially, this magic card, when it's all done and said, when it's all done, he's going to make way more money from this magic card. Probably a hundred times, including his the addition to his reputation for this magic card what he would have made if he won the gp uh, and drafting a lightning burst is not a guarantee he would have won gp las vegas not even close this is the most valuable card in the history of magic just because of what it made this particular player both in cash and fame and community support